Hello everyone and I'm back with another video and I'm going to be doing a panning tutorial but before I start this video I just want to say that my next tutorial will probably be basic transition so just drop a like if you want that to come out as soon as possible but let's just start. So we're going to start off by doing the wiggle panning. Um, So the very first thing you want to do is go to your effects and presets and search uh, wiggle. Uh, and you're going to click you're gonna find the wiggle position and drag that to your clip now what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna see wiggle amount right here change it from si from 50 to like 30 okay so the next thing you're gonna want to search for is wiggle rotation and just go ahead drag that onto your clip as well and change the wiggle rotation uh, from 30 change this to 3 alright change it to 3 that's literally all it is. It's like a nice smooth panning. Alright, now let's move on to the rough panning. Alright, so this is the photo I'm going to be using for rough panning. So what you're going to start off by doing obviously is just going to go to your effects and presets and search up S under shake. Keep in mind, you're going to have to have the sapphire plugin for this specific shake. Um, so you just drag that to your clip. Also keep in mind that you can indeed crack the Sapphire plugin. But anyways, you're going to add that to your clip and put on motion blur here, okay? Make sure motion blur is enabled. And then you're going to change the amplitude from one and change this to 0 0.221, so 0 0.221. And then you're gonna change your frequency from eight, turn it down to six. You see tilt shake right here just click on the little arrow right next to it and change tilt rand amp change this to 10 okay we're gonna close this little we're gonna click on this arrow to close it again and then we're going to go to X shake above here and change the X rand amp from 192 and lower it to 60 so now it looks like this you might be like, wait, why does it look like that? Because if you can see, it's like the, f like, it's not like, but it's not moving like this one. So you can just click on the S shake, click control A on your keyboard, control A and then control C because you copied it or just right click copy. So then we're going to delete this and pre-compose this clip and then go ahead and click control V and now it should look like that now if you were confused with what it just said please comment down below and i'm free to help you with any problems you have but thank you for watching guys um don't worry next video will be way better and please comment down suggestions for videos you want me to do next and i'll look into them and everyone thank you for supporting me it means so much and it helps me like keep on going with my youtube career so thank you guys for watching and peace